Wow! Wow! Hi guys, it's DJ here from CozyRC. We got the M500 in the workshop, but I'm at the point of going to the pond to run it again. In my latest video on the M500, I got a question on how to run 4.76mm bore props on a 4mm prop shaft. So this is a 4mm prop shaft. This is a prop with 4mm bore. So these are made for each other. Fits perfectly. No play. Align it with the drive dock here and then you see that works great. But you can also run 4.76mm bore prop. For example this one, which I just prepared. This is a 38mm 1.6 pitch prop and I'm going to try it today. But this has a too big bore, 4.76. So you see it doesn't fit straight away. But the trick here is very simple. You just use a sleeve like this. So this is just like a tube. This is a brass tube. And the inner diameter is just over 4 mm so that it slides onto your prop shaft. It's kind of a snug fit. And the outer diameter is about 4.75. And now if I put the sleeve on and then the 4.76 mm bore prop, it fits absolutely great. No play. So that's how you do it. Quite simple. I'm very curious how this prop will perform. I will take it easy because this is quite a big and aggressive prop for this little 2948 motor. Okay, so let's head out to the pond and give it a try. We're at the pond with the M500 Mini Mono. It's absolutely perfect boating weather. It's uh, mirror flat water, almost no wind, a little sun. Great. So we're going to run on a 3S 3000 milliamp hour battery with a 2948 3450 kV motor, 37 millimeter prop, 1.4 pitch. We put the GPS in, so I'm going to tape it up and then let's see. Beautiful. Awesome. Okay, so let's make a long sprint right away. It's a fresh lipo. I'll wait until the ripples cool down a bit. Okay, there we go. Nice. Okay, I have to make some steering adjustment. A little bit left trim. Great. All right, let's turn some laps. Water cooling works well. This boat is just a lap. Oh! A lap runner, I was going to say. No trim taps, but maybe there's no need, at least not in calm water. Last weekend I did a maiden run and the water was way more choppy. And I felt that it needed the trim taps, but... In this calm water... There's no need. Man! It runs nice. Oh! Oh! Wow! 
perfect 360. <laughs> nice. Unbelievable. That will make a nice intro for my video. Let's bring it in and check the speed. It's about five or six degrees Celsius in the Netherlands, so still pretty cold. So I pre-warmed the lipos and uh, basically I don't have to worry for a hot motor or a hot setup. Okay, nice. Okay, so this time the top speed is 68. Not bad. Last time I got 71 with the exact same setup. And more importantly, there's hardly any water in the hull. Just a few drops, but I'm not too worried about that. Nice. So the water leak is resolved. That's great. Okay, I'm going to put a fresh LiPo and then we're going to try a 38 1.6 pitch prop. Alright, time for the second run with a fresh LiPo and the 38 1.6 pitch prop. This is a lot of prop for this boat, so I'm going to take it easy. Let's see how it will go. Alright. Going for a sprint right away. Wow, nice, very smooth. It's faster, that's for sure. Let's make another sprint when the ripples cool down. Great. Awesome. Yeah, for uh, running laps, I think this prop is a bit too aggressive. Maybe now with the colder temperatures it's okay, but... Oh. Next run is going to be on 4S. I know that uh, a lot of you guys want to see that, so I brought a small 2200 mAh 4S pack and uh, I'm going to, sh to switch the prop back to the 437 and then we're going to see the speed. Alright, let's bring it in. I don't want to push the setup with this prop too much. All 
All right, let's see. I'm really curious about the speed. I reckon it's 70 plus kilometers an hour, at least. Okay. No smoke. Wow. 78 kilometers an hour. That's awesome. That's nearly 50 miles an hour on 3S. That is a great result. Yes, not hot at all. 78. Wow. That's an all-time record for uh, my Mini Mono on 3S. This one or the prototype which I built before. Really happy with that. All right. 4S 2200 milliamp hour pack, zero to GPS, or well, it's at five kilometers an hour. I put back the 437 prop. Let's see. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Let's directly go for a sprint for a nice top speed reading. Okay, there we go. Wow! <laughs> Man, the sound! Awesome! I did notice the boat was leaning to the left due to the torque of the prop, I guess. But man, it was fast. Nice. Let's try again. Wow. Man, I think that's 80 kilometers an hour plus, or 50 miles an hour plus. I already noticed that it is decreasing the speed. Despite the leaning to the left, it is very, very stable. Man! I reckon that with some fine tuning, Maybe some trim taps on flat water. This boat could run uh, 100 kilometers an hour plus. I also have a 4S 3000 milliamp hour battery. Oh, 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 oh! Wow. Okay, the tape came loose. Let's not. Uh, Gamble it. Let's let's quit. Let's see how fast that was. I guess 80 plus kilometers an hour, as I said. It was screaming. I love it. No way. No way. 91 kilometers an hour. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> yes. Guys, I'm so stoked about that. 91. That is absolutely crazy. Man. Let's take it out. 91. That is about 56 miles an hour, 57 miles an hour. I'm stoked. That's an all time record for any mini mono that I built so far and I even have a little bigger 4S battery which will which will increase the speed I'm I'm pretty sure that's awesome man wow I'm really stoked this is such a great boat guys thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time bye <laughs>